All right, I felt that the Lord wanted me to make another tutorial, uh, more tutorials on how to pick the best chords for any given praise song. And I've been working on O Come O Come Emmanuel for Christmas. Now here's the first chord selection, the first chord sheet. And you'll see there are many chords. Uh, let's see, C sharp minor was the best key, so let's, um, I'm coming and you will. so we have, um, a lot of chords here, now, oh, come, oh, That's almost one chord per syllable. Again, that's great as a solo pianist. There ain't nothing better. It's very beautiful. But if you're going to take this chord sheet to a worship team, nobody, only you and like one other really skilled person is going to be able to follow it. So we have to eliminate some chords. So let's go back here. <clears throat> it's the, the key. Um, so I did some math. And the chord changes should happen for the guitarist's sake. The chord changes should happen about once every two seconds for a moderate to slow song and once every one and a half seconds for a fast song. Now, if we kept all these chords, our guitarist would be changing chords about every half second. It's ridiculous to try and ask other people to do that. So... Um, the, what's going to be best is if we go, Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel. Three chords. Three. Three. So let's start with, Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel. And ransom captive. Israel. That's fine. We can eliminate a lot of these chords. So let's open up Microsoft uh, Paint. Um, or we can use Chord Pro uh, to do that. Get rid of this. And delete. Come on, come in, man. You have. I'm taking this back into the C sharp minor instead of E because it's it's a sad song and it should remain a sad song until we get to the climax that when it says literally until the son of till the son of God till the son of God appears that's when it gets happy. Emmanuel. We start the chord on the word L. Okay, cool. So Oh, oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel. Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel. Except that I think a better chord fits this. 
let's check this out. This requires a lot of music theory, and this is why I'm doing the tutorial. Let's see. Come, oh, come, Emmanuel. Okay, so this chord is good. C sharp minor. Oh, come, oh, come, oh, come, me. These two notes, the C sharp and the G sharp, they're both in the C sharp minor C sharp minor chord. Oh come, oh come, man. Suddenly we have this note. We're playing an A chord, according to the chord sheet. Man, you will. Oh come, oh come, man, you will. The problem is, is that. Come, oh come, man, you will. The chords we hit for man, you will. Those chords are not really in in the notes of the A chord. So we need to change that. Uh, the chord that I think fits better is actually an F sharp minor. Man, you will. So man, you fits the F sharp minor better because the F sharp minor has more notes in the melody. Man, you, man, you. It has two of the three notes that we sing are in the F sharp chord. And then we can go back here. Man, you, well. Back to the C sharp minor. So I think, I think it works better to do it this way. C sharp minor, oh come, oh come, E man, F sharp minor, man, you So I'll, I'll change that here. Paint, good old fashioned. Okay, I zoomed in. Control copy. Paste. Oh, come on, oh, come on, come on, come come on, come come on, come come on, come here, here's our next chord. And ransom the G sharp and ransom captive Israel. So only three chords here. Ransom I, I in Israel and L in Israel. And chord, chord, chord. Okay, we got it. <clears throat> and ransom captive Israel. That's pretty good. Let's check out the melody though. And ransom, ransom captive. I'm playing a G sharp minor. This is in the G sharp minor because this is literally G sharp. Ransom is an E in a G sharp minor? No. Ransom cap is the C sharp in the G sharp minor? No. So that is a bad chord. And rant for the melody. Well, what do we have here? Ransom captive, G sharp E, C sharp E. What we have here is the C sharp minor chord again. So I'm just going to keep this C sharp minor and ransom captive Israel. <clears throat> it's almost pretty much the same thing two times in a row. Um, but uh, it's not really. As, as we come here, we're going to find out that that's not really true. Um, we're going to change and ransom. This is too big for me to do. Pretty darn close, man. Pretty darn close is a fine line. Anyway. And come, come, man. 
Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel, and ransom captive Israel. This is fun. Israel, Israel. F sharp minor is fun. Israel. Almost the G sharp minor sounds better there. And ransom captive Israel. G sharp minor does sound better there. However, I thought of something else. I like G sharp major actually. Let's check this out. And ransom captive, ransom captive Israel. That's a very Middle Eastern sounding. A chord right there if you're in the key of C sharp minor using a G major G sharp major and ransom ransom captive is Israel, Israel So the G sharp major is gonna fit well for that and ransom captive is Israel So that's what I'm going with C sharp minor to G sharp major to C sharp minor again. Then moans in lonely exile here. I thought those chords were good, I'm gonna keep them. Then moans. Then moans in lonely exile. Here. Again, it's so few chords that our entire worship team won't be able to do it. Here we have a funky thing. Until the Son of B. Over until the Son of God appears. It's actually pretty good. Let's check the notes. Until. Until the Son. Until. That's in the B. The F sharp is in the B chord. Until the sun. Is G sharp in the B? No. I think the better chord is E. Until the sun. Until the sun of God appears. Until the sun. Two of the three notes are actually in the E major. So until the Son of God, God, God appeared. We've, we've had this melody before. Anytime you have the same melody, I like to keep the same chords. Because the worship team has already learned that given any cer a certain type of melody, we play a certain type of chords. And I keep it exactly the same. I find no reason to change it because the purpose of changing chords is to support the melody. And once you find a good fit, it's kind of nice to keep it that way. A lot of people don't. But we're going for simplicity, not extravagant coloration of chords. So, um, until E, the Son of God, F sharp minor, God appears, E. It's kind of like a little cadence, but that works. Let's take it. Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel, and ransom captive Israel, then moans in lonely exile until the Son of God appears. Rejoice! Okay, you gotta nix out this chord. Rejoice! That sounds good on the B. Rejoice! I think. <coughs> re, re, rejoice! 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 I think the G sharp major is gonna be better. Um, the G sharp minor. Rejoice, be rejoice. 
G sharp major here. The common note is this one. Rejoice till the Son of God appears. Rejoice. That's the B note. Rejoice. Rejoice. G sharp note. So. Good. Good. Get rid of that. G sharp major is going to sound better. Okay. Rejoice. Rejoice. Emmanuel. Okay, here we've already seen this melody. Come, oh, come, Emmanuel. So we need to keep the same chords. So F sharp minor and C sharp minor. <clears throat> rejoice, rejoice, Emmanuel. We need to keep the same chords because it's the same melody. It's a real simple way to fix that. Okay, continuing on. Rejoice, rejoice, Emmanuel shall come. Let's keep the E, next the B over D sharp. Shall come to thee, O Israel. Okay, so here we have a choice. Shall come to thee. Let's take rejoice, rejoice. Emmanuel shall come to the O Israel. Let's look at those notes. E e e e we can keep the F sharp. Israel. Israel. But I think what's better is to use this. They're trying to throw in another G sharp here. Oh, Israel. Because we can't hit both those chords because of, because we need to keep it easy for on our team and our guitarists. We'll be polite. We'll go. Shall come, shall come to thee, oh. Let's try the G sharp. When Israel shall come to the O Israel. But once again, um, let's hit the G sharp major. That is a very cool sounding chord. It adds some color and some flavor to the stew pot of our chord sheet in a weird analogy way. The cool thing about keeping this G sharp major, oh yes, you can sing the C note. Shall come to the O is Otherwise, you'd be singing. Shall, shall, shall come, shall come to the O is. Rael, Rael. That's a very cool chord color duration. Otherwise, you'd sing it in to come to the is Rael. That's okay. It keeps it in the same main key, the same melody, but it sounds much cooler. Come to the is Israel. Beautiful. I think we're done. Let's run it through one more time. Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel, and ransom captive Israel. That mourns in lonely exile here until the Son of God appears. Rejoice!
is rejoice real strong Emmanuel shall come to thee O Israel cool and again on the chorus you, you make it obvious this is the chorus you hit it hard and heavy and then you back off for the verses and then you hit it hard and heavy uh, a lot of times people only sing to work when the chorus um, unfortunately uh, but we worship leaders latch on to that and we just we bring you everything we got if you're gonna break a guitar string do it if you're gonna break a keyboard key oh well um, but bring it all your emotion in the chorus and then you can back off and relax on the verse and have some fun be beautiful and then full holy spirit power on the chorus cool we're done with this so now we copy all these notes to the rest the rest of the chord sheet because a verse in our chorus is done and the entire song is is done essentially all the music repeats after this so thanks for watching happy worship leading